Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Persona 5 Royal. I am filming this, this is episode 47, but I'm filming this on Halloween. Yes, this is how much I'm stockpiling, and I expect this episode to go up at about, probably the end of November, most likely, even though it's now the end of October when I'm filming this. It's Halloween right now, and this is, my house is such a sad house right now. Like, there's three pumpkins in the front yard, and... We didn't put any candy out, because I don't actually know why. We just didn't. And uh, both of our scarecrows, are they, they they fell over. So, this is just a sad... This is such a sad house. Like, what? last time, what did we even do? Yeah, we did something with Kaneshiro. We ki killed his... We didn't kill him, but we fighted the boss. Oh, this is so sad. I'm just... I'm just looking... Ow! I'm just looking at my two scarecrows yeah, I hear that. in the front yard. Ow, oh, fuck. That really hurt. I hit my knee on my desk. Ow! Um, but yeah, this is so. I'm just looking at those two scarecrows oh. laying on the ground in my front lawn. It's sad. <laughs> why are they laying in the ground? So, why can't. I mean, I guess I could pick them up, but I didn't. Well, then. Okay, well, that's my. That's, that's it for my rant. <laughs> Shiro truly was an evil stain on society. You could say that. Moshida and Matarame too. They hurt and exploited others just to satisfy their desires. Still, there were people around them who noticed their terrible deeds, weren't there? I wonder why they turned a blind eye. Why doesn't anyone help? I think it's because they probably they're probably too scared to. So it's because they don't have the courage. Probably. Humans are so weak. Humans. Hey, do you think when I touched the picture? <laughs> Why did I skip that? Came back. I tried to force myself to forget, but I really may not be human. Mm, but that's okay. Just be confident. Con confident. Confident. And even if you aren't human, just accept yourself. I accept you. Who do you think you're talking to? that I think about it. I gotta be human. I am the core of the Phantom Thieves, after all. That's true. All right. All right. Come on. It's not good for you to stay up this late. Let's go to sleep. All right. So there we go. And Velvet- Ow! Stop! Why did I- I hit the same spot on my, the desk that with my knee that I just hit a minute ago. Why does that keep happening? I don't know- I don't understand. This is just not a good day. Our master wishes to speak with you. Heed his words. What's up, Igor? You've defeated the repulsive fiend of gluttony this time. <laughs> well done. I am glad to see you have devoted yourself to your rehabilitation. Eh, yeah. You are not worthy of such kind words, inmate. I suggest you treasure them. Do you recall the whispers about that strange man? Uh, the other metaverse user? Even a chicken could remember something. Shut up, Caroline. Don't sound so cocky about it. Be quiet. The cases of those people who shut down, is it not? Indeed, I speak of another with powers similar to yours. If you are to complete your rehabilitation, you may encounter him eventually. <laughs> Yet another thing for me to look forward to. It would be greatly troubling if you were to not strengthen your abilities. I shall grant you an ability befitting of your newfound growth. Consider it a gift. All right, and there we go. Bam! All right. It's time, inmate. Return to your world. I love the Velvet Room theme. It's called Aria the So. I really like that song. Who's calling me? I bet it's Makoto. Hello? What did I say? 
I'm still asleep actually I'm just asleep talking and sleep answering my phone to make such jokes there's something I feel I should let you know Kaneshiro contacted me oh is Kaneshiro. that a good thing or a bad thing in this case he said he's calling for debt it seems he's disposed of all the photographs as well and um, well, that's good my sister and her team have taken him into custody what it appears they did not want him to disappear if you know what I mean yeah this group was called a mafia after all I wouldn't put silencing him past them yeah does this mean we were successful in changing his heart uh, yep it's hard but, to say for sure yeah. well it seems like it nothing bad has happened yeah. yet what about those psychotic breakdowns that Kaneshiro mentioned not sure but I assume he was talking about the incidents that have been all over the news lately. It really may be related to the other person who has been entering palaces. True. That said, all we can do now is wait until Kaneshiro's change of heart becomes clear to us. Thank you. <sighs> Here we go. I am too distracted right now. This is not a good time to record an episode. <laughs> I'm, I'm looking out my window like every 10 seconds because I keep seeing kids walking up down, walking up and down because it's Halloween. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> I thought I was going to be late. Customers are bickering in the convenience store this morning. Speaking of the Japanese words for high horse and Nauru Rishi, both originated as shogi terms. A lot of people aren't familiar with shogi, but it's good to know a little bit about it. <laughs> Hello, Maggie Kun, have you seen this picture before? What, do you know the what do you think it says on the back of this piece? Um, probably gold. This is it. Exactly. That's right. The lance and the silver gen general also have kanji for gold on the back. By the way, it said that the two on the back of this palm piece is a cursive form of gold. In shogi, you can choose to promote your pieces under certain conditions. If a knight c crosses into enemy territory, for instance, they can promote becoming as mobile as the gold general. A weak piece like a pawn can become gold if you get it to into the enemy's camp. That was... Why was that was that was rough reading that sentence? I don't know why. I don't know what's wrong with me today. All right. By the way, Novi Rije is like uh, is like to wear expense clothes, expensive clothes because of a desire to be acknowledged. Once humans fulfill the basic needs of clothing, food, and shelter, our next desire is recognition. That's why people try to make themselves seem bigger by flaunting their power through money. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. All right. All right. Next. What to do today? Somebody's texting. I think you made it. Call Brits. That's not good. The one's responsible for the calling card. I ask you that you try to not stand out for a while. By the way, I usually spend my time in the student council room. If there's ever an emergency, feel free to come find me there. Alright, sounds good. Kasumi! I'm gonna hang out with you. Because you are the best. I'm um, sorry, Yusuke. Sorry, on. Um. Shoot, but I don't have a faith persona and I knew that I was gonna face this problem because I remember Specifically when I was in the velvet room um, Not too many episodes ago like two episodes ago, and I was like, okay I can fuse Phoenix now or I can wait until Kasumi wants to hang out and then fuse him then well Kasumi wants to hang out now <laughs> so <laughs> Yeah Let's just go. Okay, so I need to fuse um, Sudamata, I believe. Um, yes. Um, 
Um, okay. So, I'm trying to think. I need Phoenix, because Phoenix is of the Faith Arcana. I need Kodamata because of that. And to get Kodamata, I need Angel, which I don't think I have Angel either. This is just a course of, like, just slowly becoming insaner. Okay, I can do... Oh, I can do Kushimitama and Bicorn. I'm... Yeah, I have Kushimitama and Bicorn. Um, I don't... No, I don't think I have... Well, let's look. I don't think I have Bicorn, but might as well look. Um, let's see. He'll be in the Hermit Arcana. And the answer is... No. That's what I thought. Um, so to fuse Bicorn, we need Mana Drake and Jack-O-Lantern. Which, Jesus Christ, some kids just screamed. <laughs> down my street. <laughs> okay, we need Jack o' Lantern and Mana Drake. Which we have both of those, luckily. Alright, so then, um, too bad I, um, I think I just got rid of Kushimitama, oops, Kushimitama from my companion because I didn't think I needed him. But I guess I was wrong. Um, I don't really care. I'm never going to use this persona, so it doesn't really matter to me. <laughs> I mean, he's level 4. When am I going to need to use a level 4 persona? Me buy corn. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, that's, that's, basically, that's, like, literally the best paraphrasing you could have gotten of what he just said. Um, okay. Um, yes. Kushimitama. Oh, wow. He's, like, the very last persona. Okay, and we're gonna create Phoenix. Yeah, save our bloodline is fine. We'll do it. That, we'll do that. Medea. Um, not yet, because I want to see the other things. Um, yeah, Medea. That'll be fine. Alright. Now we have the persona I need. Alright. Ooh, we learned Diorama. That's good. Um, ooh, and we learned Recarm next. Wow, this is just cool. All around. No slacking off. Okay, so that's the first thing I need to do. Next up is I'd like to, before I hang out with Kasumi, I want to return this DVD and get a new one. What would you like? Um, kindness, efficiency. Why don't we, why don't we do kindness? I mean, we're going to basically watch them all at some point, so... Doesn't really matter, but um, all right, Kasumi, I'm coming your way. I hope you don't mind. She isn't responding. Oh, her phone's acting up. You need to like get a better phone. Your phone breaks too much. <laughs> okay. I'm sorry I called you here so suddenly. Since our talk, I've been trying to think of things besides gymnastics that I'm really interested in, and then I figured something out. L it, it's this. Um, making pento? Yes. Yeah, I can cook. You really need to regulate your diet and gymnastics, so I've been making my own food a lot. And so, since I also wanted to thank you, I made you bento. This is actually my first time cooking for someone else besides my family, but I figured this would definitely help me get my confidence back. I made this specifically with your body type in mind and knowing how much you exercise. Do you want it? I mean, it looks pretty good. That's for sure. And it's all yours. The chicken and eggs are to help you with fatigue. There are some beans in there too, and it's on brown rice. Weight control is important, uh, control is important for gymnastics, but we also need to make sure we've got energy and stamina too. So a high protein, low fat is usually what we go for. You also need iron to maintain stamina and vitamin B for energy. Wow, I'm like getting a whole nutrition, nutrition, nu nutrition lesson. That's what I was trying to say. Let's dig in. Is that all for you? That looks like a lot of food. Of course, I'll need every last grain of rice. Why do you look so skeptical, Amagi-san? I guess it might look like a lot, but this is actually a little less than usual. Whoa, a little less? Okay. Don't worry, I've done the math on the calories. I'll burn all of this off at practice. So Come on, senpai. You you'll be done before you know it. Well, okay. <laughs> I guess. This is... It's a familiar flavor, but it doesn't match the food. 
I keep trying different parts, but it all tastes like the same thing. Something very familiar. I'm like you, Senpai. You, you okay? Your eyes are glazing over. That's definitely unique. I'll tell you that. You think so? I don't think it's all that weird for an athlete. Heavy seasoning would probably be bad for you, so I went easy on it. Hmm. Was it too light? Excuse me. Mmm, yeah, that's the flavor I was going for. I was trying to decide how to season these, and I figured everyone likes curry, right? So I decided to go for maximum curry flavoring. I'm sorry, were you not a fan of that flavor? Or wait, maybe you just prefer the super spicy ones? Uh, is there a third option here? I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry to no, it's fine, Kasumi. You'll- oh my god, no, 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 no. Should I get mayonnaise? Soy sauce? Mitsu, do you think Dr. Maruki will have some salt? Um, no, it's fine. Don't worry about it. Oh, you're right. I should just buy something new. Something new you can eat right now. No. I mean, this works fine as is. Um, but... Well, thank you. Now we should really eat. Yeah. Thank you for the- Whew, that was delicious. Thank you for completely finishing your meal, Amagi-senpai. I'm sorry it didn't turn out perfectly. I came up with the idea of making bento, but I couldn't decide on the flavor. Either way, I'm really sorry. I'm so embarrassed. I thought it was so great when I presented it to you, and now... Eh, it's fine. I mean, it happens. We make mistakes. Thank you very I suppose so. Thank you. Next time, I'll ask you what you like before I try anything too crazy. I'll go buy that super spicy Megado sauce for next time. <laughs> <laughs> it seems like you're always forced... Uh, forcing... Where did I get- where did that word even come from? Always helping me find my way forward, senpai. If I didn't have you, I'd let my failures get to me and end up in some big pessimistic spiral again. Maybe this kind of confidence can help me figure out who I really am. Yeah. Probably. Either way, I suppose all I can do now is keep moving forward. Am I, didn't you already say that? I'm like, senpai, I hope we can keep helping each other improve. Well, that was, uh, kind of a long confidence session. Not that that was bad. Or not that that's bad, it was long, but, like... It's very meaningful. We learned a lot from it. Okay, now that we've gotten all our nutrients, it's time for the next phase. I don't mean to be too demanding, but I'm going to train you even harder than before. Make sure you keep up. All right. All right. Our max HP increased by Maybe five, so. which is good. All right. Evening time. It is. Ah, you're back. Um, what can be done today? Oh, my phone's gonna go off first. You know, I've been curious. What's Kosei like? Is it filled with guys like Yusuke? I imagine there are a lot of different people there. Not that you mention it, I have one very interesting classmate. She is a female shogi player and seemingly quite the skilled one at that. Are you talking about that Hifumi Togo? I remember hearing she's a student at Kosei. They say she's the most beautiful shogi player around right now. Dude, that sounds too good to be true. Give me some more info. I do not know much about her. She is not that kind, the kind of person to let others close to her. It sounds like she only focuses on her shogi pursuits. After all, it's said that she's a lone genius. However, I have heard she is commonly seen at the church over in Kanda. For real? We gotta go. You'll probably get struck down by a bolt of lightning if you're going for that alter ulterior motive. That ain't it. This is for the Phantom Thieves. I mean, Shogi's a kind of battle, right? She's gotta know all sorts of insane strategies and stuff. Uh... That is quite the stretch. Churches are supposed to be holy. Don't do this, Ryuji. Alright, you guys are gonna pay for this one day. Ken, you go spy on her for me. Find out if she's really as cute as she s they say she is. Let's ignore that idiot. Anyway, a shogi expert, huh? Striking an enemy with but a moment's inspiration? Skillfully strategizing toward victory? Those might actually be good tactics to know for our work as the Phantom Thieves. We said she's at the church in Kanda, right? We should check it out when you have the time. Oh, I wonder if that could be another confidant. <laughs> I mean, there is 22, and there's no way we have 22 yet. Right. I mean, we have a lot, but we don't have anywhere close to 22. Alright, Kawakami. I know, Kawakami, I keep putting you out to the side. By the way, I've, this is something I forgot to mention. I was going to mention this, like, a while ago, but I never really did. Um, so... Persona 5 Royal was actually originally going to be, or not Royal and the original, was originally going to actually be a lot harder because, wait, is the next request open? I just want to check out. Because if it's not, then that's cool. Um, okay, no. You can tell when, like, there's a, you know, a request open when Justine is standing here by the door, but it's not. 
So, um, in Persona, the, all the Persona games before this, three and four, um, there's this thing where if you did, if you uh, spent, uh, if there was a long time where you didn't spend with a confidant, like if you took a long break from a confidant and didn't spend time with them for a while, they would actually lose interest in you and the confidant would literally fall apart. They don't do that anymore. You want to purchase a holy stone, how huh? for just 100,000 yen, you can change your fate. Mm. Well, for the confidant, thank you very much. Here you go. There's our holy stone, and there goes 100,000 yen. Mm -hmm. mm, it's the smart thing to do, considering this is the only way to avoid misfortune. It's already ch charged with happiness, or, 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 so you'll feel the effects right away. Don't forget to recharge it with moonlight every three days. Please stop by again and let me know how your cha fate changed. Goodbye. Well, maybe we will not die. Uh. Oh, you're home. I was just about to close up shop, but I forgot to turn the stove off. I guess you start forgetting things the more the older you get. Last time we went to the fortune teller, the chief won the lottery. I wonder what kind of luck we'll have this time around. Should be awesome, right? I mean, we paid a hundred, a hundred thousand yen. Wait, I think the the good luck was us not dying and him remembering to turn the stove off. We paid a hundred thousand yen for this holy. Ow! What the heck? Hey, can't you keep this thing a little cleaner? I can't be comfortable with all this gravel at the bottom of the. Wait, Ken, I have a bad feeling about this. What? Hey, hey do you mind looking over the shop while I? For real? The, the stone shattered! What? What's going into you? Whoa. Huh? This tastes salty. Hey, the holy stone is just salt. Mm -hmm. Ken, what's going on? I'm just a bit salty. That is such a good response. You're salty? That reminds me, I was just about to head out and grab some salt for the shop. I'll be back in a bit. Hmm. Hmm, I think this is technically rock salt. I've seen the chief grinding some up before. Wait, in that case... Maybe the holy stone is supposed to help you get a better at cooking? Uh, no, that doesn't sound right to me. But, but if that's not it, then what's it all for? Hold on a second. The holy stone was supposed to change your future, not improve your cooking skills. Wait. So the holy stone was really just a phony stone in the end? Yeah, well, we need to go talk to Chihei about that, because that is just not right. That is all kinds of wrong. It's so hot and humid. I wish the rainy season would end soon. By the way, June's almost over. We defeated Kanashiro, so we can rest easy for a while, I guess. So, what do you want to do today? Maybe something like a trip to Mementos? Actually, um, we're going to do that very soon. We'll probably... Uh, I'm going to try to do that next episode, actually. But not right now. Hmm. I mean, breaks are important, but we have those requests on the message board, so don't forget to answer them. And tonight I need, I absolutely need, well, never mind if it's raining, I don't need. Um, but, I really need to, um, go and see the whole thing with, what, how, what the situation in, um, Kiji Joji with that old man is, depending on if it's raining or not tonight. Um, okay, so let us, we're going to, what are we, what am I gonna do? Persona? Um... You know what we can do? Why don't we do this? Okay, uh, we might be able to do this. We might not be able to. It's going to be a valiant effort. If we can't, then I mean, there's nothing we can do about that. And if we can, then it will be good news. Hi, Makoto. Hey. All we can do now is wait. Hmm? Start change. I came to see. Do you have a minute? Yes, I do have enough knowledge. I mean, I guess I can lend an ear. Very much. Why not? All right. Well, let's go to the courtyard. I'd like to talk to you about something. Do you have a moment? Ah, uh, yes, sure I do. Up until now, I've been the quintessential honor student. I believe I've been handling my position as student council president with ease as well. Yeah. And I don't mean that in a boasting way. That's simply how I've thought about it. But in the end, I was unable to make any kind of impact with either Suzui-san or Kanashiro. Turns out there's no use for a rule-abiding honor student when things get rough. Now that I'm a member of this team, I want to do everything I can to help you all. 
All my studying up to this point has kept me quite narrow-minded. Uh huh. I think I will need to broaden my horizons somewhat. Oh, okay. Um. Well, what do you plan on doing then? You're gonna broaden your horizons. Will be to learn more about the other students. But I struggle with that. There seems to be a disparity between my tastes and those of my peers. Hmm. I wouldn't say that that's necessarily true. Really? I hope you're right. But I don't even know where people like to go for fun. It would be nice to have a grasp of such concepts. Plus, the student council must be responsible for understanding the student body they serve, right? I don't mean that in a surveillance way. I just want to know them as people. I may be a phantom thief, but that's no excuse for me to start ignoring my presidential duties. Yeah, that's true. Back to the topic at hand. Where do people usually go for fun? Um, I mean, it just depends on who you are. I mean, there's whole different places for fun. I, you know, I'm a gamer, so I usually go to the arcade a lot, but... I often hear people talking about going to the arcade. To be perfectly honest, I've never been to one myself. Do you think you could take me? I'm not sure if it'll broaden my horizons per se, but simply studying won't get me anywhere. Mmm, why don't we go now? It'll be it'll be a nice little field trip. Why not? Thank goodness. I think I would have been totally lost in there had I gone by myself. Well, let's get going. Alrighty. We're going to the arcade with Makoto and it's exciting. Awesome. So this is where everyone comes to enjoy themselves. Don't take that line out of context, because that could be more girls yikes. Here than I expected. Hey, over there! What are you, you hey over there about? Gun at the screen, right? That actually seems somewhat realistic. <laughs> yeah. Uh, do you want to try it? You can. I if it's okay with you, do you think you could well, teach me? Why wouldn't it be okay with me? You just point the gun at the screen. I mean, it's kind of realistic, actually. It's like an actual, you know. She, <laughs> uh, she seems to be having a bit too much fun with that. Oh, so this is how it is. <laughs> well, what did you think it was? Of course, that was just a game. But I wonder if I could apply some of the techniques I learned here during battle. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it might just work. You never know, right? It's going somewhere I don't normally frequent is what helped me come up with that idea. You know, it may only be a little bit. I think I'm starting to understand how people pass time. Interesting. I would have never even thought about coming here before. Yeah. Um. You have a lot to learn still, though, if you're going to be a real gamer. Hey, do you think you could help me out again later? Uh, I mean, sure. I give the team more ideas if I can gain increased knowledge outside of my studies. Yeah, I don't mind. That's fine. Thank you can do that. Perhaps it won't be immediately, but I'm sure I can be of use. It's been a while since we've seen this time things happen and uh, us being in the interrogation room. I feel like it's been a while since this has happened. There must have been people who obstructed your actions as the Phantom Thieves. You managed to overcome them because you had someone who specialized in analyzing enemies. Isn't that right? I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the priestess persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. So there we go. Priestess Arcana. Um, Makoto was of the Priestess Arcana. By the way... You went to the red light district when you were chasing after Kanashiro, right? Yeah, why? Would you want to go there at some point? No, no not for my own purposes. 
I wasn't I wasn't assuming it was for your own purposes. I recently got a report that one of our students was spotted there. I'm skeptical. Mm. I'd like to confirm firsthand for myself. Yeah, we'll be can. It's getting late. Let's go home. Sounds like a good idea to me. All right. Thank you. Thanks for setting aside some time for me today. It's always hard for me to come to places like this on my own, so you've been a big help. I've had all kinds of new experiences today, and it's even been a little fun. Well, yeah. We should go again. Yes. Good idea. After all, there's clearly plenty more I can learn. But before that, we should go to the red light district, like we discussed before. Alright. All right. Careful on your way home. Don't, like, trip into any... Ditches, I don't know. Oh my god, I'm looking out my windows. I got freaking dinosaur walking down the street. What even is this right now? 2020, man. 2020. Hey, inmate. Oh! Um, Caroline and Justine? Hey! Um... Yeah, I will... No, I'm not going to... Hold on. Let's, let's figure some things out first. Okay, so the cheerful fortune teller is available, but there's a few things I need to get um, sorted out first. So let's go to PG Joji really quick because I hey, hey. need to, yeah, I need to identify the target. But before I do that on my way, I want to see me? if I know what um, location. Yeah, the church. Okay, so they want to go to the, the church in Conda. We'll do that soon, um, probably in the next episode or two. I don't know. I don't think ah, we might do it this episode no i don't think we will there's no rush it's not like you know i mean they give us i mean yes there is a time limit but they give us like a month to do it you know it's not like you, you have like two days you know that old man hasn't come yet no wonder i'm drinking in peace i don't like bad mouthing my customers but he makes so much trouble it's an old man making trouble hey do you think they're talking about the elderly man causing trouble in kiji joji hey this ain't no place for a young man like you you looking for something around here uh, who, yeah, the elderly troublemaker, I'm interested. Who, boy, so even kids like you know about him. That old man's out of control. He takes drinks from strangers, he starts fights, and when he gets into trouble, he causes a ruckus and tries to mooch money off people. What's creepy is the more trouble he makes, the wider his smile gets. Do you know his name? Oh, yeah, the old man always shouting his name over and over. Heji Ono, right? Yep, that's the name. Okay. Alright, we got the name of our target. Well, that was easy. I wish he didn't hang around here, but he stayed warm with his family and said, Alright, you might sound awfully sympathetic, but I know you really think he's a pain in the ass. Well, I'm not denying that. His joints hurt on rainy days, poor guy. I think we got all the new info we need. Why don't we talk about it at the hideout? Alright, so with... Whoops, didn't mean to talk to you again. Um, So with that, I think we should have every request that we have so far ID'd. Yep, every one of them. Um, Okay, so... Let's see what's on our to-do list right now. In the near future, we need to, like, on the list of important things, we need to go to the Tier of Fortune Teller one more time. That'll be tonight. Go to Mementos, which is probably what we'll do tomorrow. Start um, Hifumi Toko's Confidant. Start the o Oya's Confidant. And go to um, the church with the twins. That is all stuff that we need to do sooner rather than later over the course of the next episode or two next couple of days um although probably more than an episode or two might like two or three episodes because mementos within itself is gonna take it to all right so let's visit shia hey Let, let's ask about the shia about the holy stone hmm she's with the client sounds like they're talking about the holy stone you want to eavesdrop on them of course why wouldn't you eavesdrop on them? <laughs> how are you healing I'm fine. It's my fault anyway. You know, said so. He says he doesn't want to hit me, but I, it, but I just make him so mad. I suggest you break up with him. Things are only going to get worse at this rate. But I'm the only person that cares about him. If I leave, how will he survive? Please, is there any other way? Now. Let us ask the, the terror. That sign of final fate. Yes, I've seen everything. Hmm. I can sense a dark presence within your boyfriend. His heart seems to be possessed by a demon. The demon may hide itself away at times, but when it strikes, it will bring it. It will bring it with a great misery. Well, what kind of misery? You will be hospitalized for severe injuries suffered in a domestic abuse incident, and he will be arrested. What? Hospitalized? Uh, arrested? I knew I shouldn't have let you throw away my holy stone. 
He said I shouldn't be wasting my money on some dumb rock, and that I should be giving it to him instead. This is my punishment for letting him do that, right? Please let me buy another one from you. What? But what? You want another? My next stone will need to be even bigger. I'm a little low on cash at the moment, but you said I can pay it up to 36 installments, right? Um, truthfully, I feel breaking up with him would be the best. I can't abandon you, ya! For real? She really thinks her boyfriend will stop being abusive as long as she has a holy stone. There's no way that could be true, right? Uh, it's just a, it's just rock salt. There's nothing else to do it, right? It would make our jobs way easier if you could really change someone's heart with a holy stone. It's clear that Chia Hei has some fortune testing, testing, t t fortune telling skills, but that stone isn't going to do anything. Hey Ken, why don't we change that you or your guys heart ourselves? I mean, he's hurting this woman here, right? This is the perfect chance for the Phantom Thieves to save her. Hmm. Hmm. Meowing. What? Hey, hey. Were you eavesdropping on us? That's an invasion of privacy, you know. That stone won't help her. It's a scam. Th that's not true. You seem to, you see you see some fates in the world are simply inescapable. The demon within your boyfriend's heart cannot be ex extorted by normal human methodologies. Fate is absolute. Although I guess you might be able to control the demon's temper if you bought another holy stone. Um, I'm not entirely sure who you are, but do you know of any other way I can approach the problems? What's his na full name? Huh? His full name is Yuya Yuchimaru. Um, why do you want to know? What are you planning on doing? Yes, what do you expect to change with that m major information? Just you wait, Yuya. You'll see. I dropped my controller. <laughs> what? You honestly believe you can do something? I, I trust you. Excuse me? It feels like he's telling the truth. Besides, Yu Yu has all my money. He's going to pay me back someday. But for now, I would rather put my trust in this one boy than in 36 payments for a holy stone. What? You, what do you think you're doing? If you keep making false accusations like that, the divine power will rain punishment down upon you. Ooh, I'm so scared. You look pleased with yourself. Hmm, I've seen everything. A vision of you groveling on the ground. Fate cannot be changed, and I will prove that fact to you. If that woman stays with her abusive boyfriend, she will meet a horrible injury within a year's time. Now, if you honestly believe you can change her destiny, go ahead and try. But once you realize that error in your thinking, come back and let a true expert handle things. I will save her with a holy stone. Well then, are we done here? I'm way too busy for this. There we go. That is the request that we were looking for. Chihei's confidant is like probably one of the, I wouldn't say hardest confidants to start, but it like takes the most like, you know, things to do to get the ball rolling. Hey. I was able to grab a seat on the bus, how about that? Um, I guess we can read Medjed Menace, why not? Hmm? Good or evil, the threat of Medjed can be felt all over the world. There's a danger afoot in the internet world, whatever. Didn't finish. I skipped breakfast, so now I'm hungry. I want something filling, but with summer coming up, I'm worried about having too many calories. Why don't we get tea? The diner in Shibuya serves fruity. It smells good. It's great for your skin, and it totally increases your charm. Fruity? What a cute name. Sounds yummy. Being stylish starts from the inside out, after all. Guess I'll try some. Wow. Fruity, huh? Sounds like a hip drink that's real popular with the ladies. You wanna try some? I mean, it doesn't sound that bad. Nice. No rule against dudes drinking it. If it tastes good and makes you more stylish, might as well, right? Yeah, so basically that's saying that... Oh, hi, Makoto! Um, basically that fruity thing was saying that, yeah, there's a new thing at the diner called fruity, which if you order it, increases your charm. So. Pretty useful. Pretty cool. Well, Open your textbooks. You Today we'll be talking about the Three Kingdoms period. A variety of heroes battling for dominance. Truly an epic time. Charismatic rulers and warlords with the, with the command of a thousand men may have led their own appeal. But personally, I think that the strategists who support them can't be ignored. Now then, Amagi-kun. What? 
And the book Xing Yu Lang of Shu is famous for his exploits during the Battle of Red Cliffs. He's also the inventor of the Bazooey, a kind of round dumpling, but their original name was based on their appearance. What's the meaning of the original Chinese phrase that these dumplings' name came from? It was Barbarian's Head. That is correct. It, its original name, Manto, came from a phrase meaning a barbarian's head. At this time, one's, one region's barbarians would use a person's head as an offering to soothe the deity of a flooding river, but Zhu Lang made a bowsy in the shape of a head as a substitute. Again, another tough sentence. <laughs> another rough sentence that was not the easiest to read through. These days, you can find bowsy with e cute faces on them. If you think about their origin, it's not too off the mark. I never knew strategists came up with cooking and not just strategists. Makoto's our strategist. Want to see what she can cook up? That, I don't like the sound of that. That does not sound very good. Alright, so, unless it's like an afternoon or lunchtime thing. Nope, um, there isn't. So, we're going to... Actually, can anybody even hang out today? Oh, Aunt can hang out. But nobody cares about Aunt, no. Um, today, we are going to... Well, I'm going to end the episode here first, but... Next time, we will be going into Mementos. Actually, wow, right? It's been like... So, it's literally been... Uh... 20... It's been like 30 episodes since we've been in... Since we were first introduced to Mementos. And we're finally actually going back here. So, hope you all enjoyed today's video. And yeah, I'll see you next time. Where we will go to Mementos. And take care of some requests. And stuff. So, till then, hope you have a great day. See you next time. Bye, everyone.